How's it going lads, Phil Potto here, welcome to the 17th episode of Road to a Better Bollocks FC. We start off this episode by getting a lovely little crest for our club, you know, look at that up in the top left corner, absolutely beautiful. And here you're just seeing me buying a few players who are very cheap and I sell them off, you'll see that later on in the episode. Now we, we buy our main man, Willy Caballero, and I made a little animation, so if you like the animation, leave a like and tell me what you think. I've said this before, you cannot have a pair of bollocks without a willy. It's funny that Willy Caballero actually looks like a testicle. Double him up and your Willy is now a pair of ghoulies. <laughs> anyway, let's get cracking into the episode. So as you can see from that very detailed animation, <laughs> uh, Willy Caballero was just born for Bollocks FC. He even looks like a bollock himself. Absolute cracking stuff. But anyway, uh, as you can see there from a couple of seconds ago, uh, we sold a good few of those players, but we had trouble selling Amor Bieta and uh, Berbatov. They didn't sell very, you know, as well as I thought they would, because Amor Bieta is a new uh, transfer, you know. But anyway, this guy's got a five star, or he's got five five star skillers, and uh, he was just a lunatic. Look at these, look at this for a tackle. At first, I was like, geez, that's harsh, but no, it was a two footed challenge. Uh, you cannot blame him for that. And then Rojo, or Rojo, uh, our new sign and gets off the mark with a nice little goal. Not, well, not a nice goal, it's actually an ugly, filthy, disgusting goal, but uh, <laughs> we'll just ignore that. And look at this work from Levetti. This is Levetti's episode. You'll see that uh, in a couple of games, you'll see what he does. And I've never seen it before, and I just love it. But, um, Nice, you know, simple penalty. I was like, grand, he's down to 10, man. I'm 2 1 up. But here's me acting the absolute retard. Look at this. Oh, Jesus. I was like, no, oh, no, Willie. <laughs> Willie, what have you done to me? <laughs> oh, God. I say my, my, my neighbors are wondering why I'm shouting, Willie, what have you done to me? But he goes down to 9 men, and this at this stage, I'm kind of going right. This is going to be an easy win. I'm going to win 4 5 2, you know, and easy peasy. But it wasn't to be. There's Willie's first save for the team. I was delighted because he conceded two shitty goals at the start. And I was kind of going, oh, God, this is the, my most expensive player. Is he worth it? I do not know. I'm not sure just yet. We'll have to play a few more games with him to see what, if he's worth the 19k I spent on him. But uh, lovely bit of work for Palacio. But this game, because he was down to nine men, I felt like I wasn't able to tramp. You know, just and just get that goal. I felt it had to be a half decent looking goal, and it just I was getting so frustrated with myself. It wasn't to be in this. Uh, look, I'm down. I'm playing a guy with nine men. How am I not beating him? Um, and I obviously, as you can see, I'm making all of the chances, and it just wasn't to be. So I finished two, two all, and um, I was pissed off with that. I actually punished myself. I flicked myself in the in the air. You know when people flick you in the air, it's really sore. It doesn't have, have the same effect because you're not expecting it when people flick you in the air, but if you flick yourself in the air, it's just, it's sore, but like, it wasn't enough punishment for, for me. But anyway, we kind of get over that that uh, poor performance of the two all, absolute load of shite. And um, we come up against a very strong looking Bundesliga team. And uh, here we go. Obviously, if you're a player with a Bundesliga team, you sweat like a dirty bollocks. And this is what your man did. And the snow didn't help like think about it it's the 5th of july we're playing in Turin, and it's snowing in juve stadium how ridiculous is that <laughs> but anyway uh lamella is you know just absolutely brilliant that was a super finish uh manuel neuer hadn't got a hope and look at this this just wasn't our game again i was starting to get frustrated we were playing some beautiful stuff here because your man defensively he was pretty solid. He was basically, um, you know, standing off the whole time. And Lucho Gonzalez almost scores a screamer just before half time. But like I said yesterday, it is not crossbar challenge, baby. Uh, <laughs> well, I don't know if you saw there at half time, but um, it was two all. He had two shots and he scored both of them. So I was kind of like, come on, Willie, get your act together. Uh, and this is some lovely football, but Lamella wasn't able to finish it off, unfortunately. And uh, this frustrates me. Now, Felipe Santana get, jumps up, wins the header, but I have a man on the post, and the lad on the post just hit him in the shin guard and went in. It's like, oh, I couldn't care less. But straight away, we get back. It's 3-2, and uh, look look at the time. It's the 90th minute. I was like, I cannot draw the first game of Division 1 and then lose the second one. So I was focusing so hard, my brain nearly fell out of my ears. But Zarate with a cracking little pass. Uh, that's not the first time he's set up a player like that. Do you remember my best goal ever in the series? Uh, it's, I'll link the, that episode in the description. But uh, 
it, he his passing was just I don't know if it's fluke like his passing is so shit that it fills the defenders or something but uh, <laughs> I didn't care too much but he come up against this guy and he's got a Premier League team and I haven't played too many Premier League teams in this series so far um, but lovely football once again I score one of my favourite goals ever uh, this is the, the thing I was telling you about at the start of the series. This is Lovetti's episode, and you'll see why here. Now, unfortunately, we go down 1-0 early in the game, but I didn't really mind because I was feeling very strong at the start of the game. I, I had a decent chance with Schaffer, but look at this from Lovetti. Oh, look at that. That is absolutely beautiful. Here's a little replay for man and looking stupid. Uh, that is absolutely beautiful. That's going in a FIFA Fridays. By the way, I will have a an episode of FIFA Fridays out next Friday. I haven't done one in months. Um, but, you know, I might as well because I have a few clips. And they're a bit different. I'll be including that and uh, the goal I scored in one of the previous episodes. And look at that from Levetti. That is absolutely super stuff. I do not think I would have scored that if I didn't have my shooting on semi because I really kind of pushed that right to the edge. I felt good. Once I hit it, I knew it was going in. And uh, look, this is just me absolutely ripping the shit out of the Iran. Uh, it's probably, you know, that was a bit of a fail. Like, I forgot that Lamella is going to turn the wrong way. But look at this, just absolute rubbish. And uh, I end up scoring from it. And then I just started laughing to myself. I go, that goal was like Irish dancing, you know. It was like I was doing the river dance. Uh, <laughs> but I didn't mind it, you know. I went 3-1 up and there was no other goals in the game, unfortunately. Um Nearly scored a nice goal here as well. But uh, that was it. Finished 3-1. We signed a few players again to, to kind of trade off and see how we do. And uh, we'll see how we do with them in the next episode. So if you enjoyed this episode, leave a like. Uh, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. That means the world to me. And that's it. And I will talk to you tomorrow, you be bollocks.